Yeah, I'm dripping junker. How are we doing everyone? Ralph here, Ralphie's Reviews, Team Knucklehead. A um, bit of a new thing, as you probably gathered from a little clip before with our crazy Professor London Burger doing the uh, Juice of the Week. Yeah, jingle. We're going to try something fucking new. Now, if it flops, it fucking flops, and this will be the, the first and only ever. Uh, it'll be fucking deleted and we'll forget about it. I've denied all fucking knowledge. What we're going to do, we're going to do juice of the fucking week. Now, what I'm going to do every week, I'm going to choose uh, a flavour range, a manufacturer, uh, a something, a group of juice. I'm going to do a quick intro like this to tell you all about them. And we're going to bang a fucking discount code out, which you will get at the end of this video. Now, it's only going to run for a week. So depending on when you're watching this, you may well have missed the boat. It is at present Sunday the 4th of March 2018. Like I don't know what year it is. So this will end on the 11th of March 2018. The discount code will be dead and fucking buried. If you want to get juice at a knockdown price, use the discount code that I'm going to put at the end of the video. Okay. Simple, isn't it? And we'll see how it goes. So the first ever, and if it flops, the only fucking ever, juice of the week that we're looking at is Suicide Serum. Yeah, fucking bollocks. We got this in just after the last expo because I tried it and fucking was blown away. Um, made by the people who, well actually it's made by Juice Source, sorry, in this country, but it's made on behalf of the people that make the suicide mods. So it's a fake company making juice, nothing doing that. Four flavours. We have got my particular favourite, which is Ars, Nick. Careful how you say that. Which is described as a sinfully succulent vanilla pudding infused with a biting zesty lemon sauce. I am not reading this. No, I am. Um, yeah, I'm not over keen on lemon. I like the lemon tarts, I like a bit of pound cake. Yada yada, none of them sort of stick with me. They're okay for a bit, a bottle or two, and then I'm like, I'm not that fussed. Fuck you, now I've done some of this shit. I've done bottles and fucking bottles and bottles. I've always got one in my rotation. So that's my favorite out of the bunch. There's three more flavors. There's cyanide, right? Which is an indulgent, Indulgent donut injected with a thick vein clotting vanilla custard and dusted with golden Biscoff crumbs. Now Biscoff is the fucking little cinnamony gingerbready biscuits that you get in when you have a coffee in fucking Nero's or Cafe or fucking wherever you go, Starbucks or whatever. It's them little coffee biscuits. So it's a little bit cinnamony, it's a little bit nutmega. And yeah, I think that the it's not my favourite, but it's fucking nice. They're all nice. The description certainly describes it well. It's quite heavy on cinnamon when it's fresh. So, if you like cinnamon, you'll fucking love it. If you don't like cinnamon, chances are you won't like it. I like it, but I do find the cinnamon quite strong for me. I like a little touch of cinnamon, like our governor. Um, so there's your cyanide. Next on the agenda, we've got... Hemlock, yeah, so they're all named after poisons. They are all with a suicide, going with a suicide thing, ain't they? What's your poison? It says on the uh, on the label there. So you're gonna kill yourself with arsenic, cyanide, or hemlock. Hemlock is a yes, it is as well. A wickedly rich vanilla, sorry, a wickedly rich banana pound cake 
drowned in a luscious caramelized Biscoff spread. So again, it's got a little touch of, uh, excuse me, it's got a little touch of the biscuits, the old coffee biscuits, it's a little bit cinnamony. Quite strong for me again, the cinnamon is not overpowering, but it is the flavour that lasts uh, before, after and during you're aware of the fucking cinnamon. It's not undertones of, it's quite strong. Maybe it will settle with a good steep, maybe it will settle with a good breathe, maybe you like cinnamon, you know, I'm not uh, uh, overly keen, but uh, fucking nice stuff for it. And the last one, this is the newest one to the range, Belladonna. Yeah, which I fucking like as well. It's lovely stuff. It is basically, it's pancake with a hazelnut chocolate spread. So it's Nutella pancakes. What's not to fucking like? Our Eric that works for us, he uh, is on this keto plan, same as I am. So it's high fat, medium protein, low carbs. And he's gutted that he can't have Nutella pancakes. So when I got this in, I told him it was extra special for him and off he skipped like with the fucking yay, life's worth living again. And it does what he says on the fucking packet. Yeah, it is Nutella pancakes. The hazelnut's quite strong. Um, it's probably the most dominant of the flavours, which I think will, will ease off with a good steep. Um, and again, I like fucking hazelnut vapes, so I've not got an issue with it. I really, really like it. It's my second favourite after the uh, arsenic, yeah. So for me, it's arsenic, belladonna, cyanide, and last but not least, hemlock. That's my preferred choices, but they're all fucking great. It's a really good juice range. Um, we're running it currently at 30 fucking percent off. So it's a 100 mil short fill in a 120 ml bottle, so you can add two nicotine shots to make it three milligrams if that floats your boat. 30% off with the code that's appearing on the screen now. Ends Sunday the 11th of March, 2018. You gotta be in it to fucking win it, isn't it? Give them a go. If you're thinking of looking for a new short fill juice, these are a fucking really good range. Um, I'm really happy to feature them in this week's Ralphie's Juice of the Week. And if you like it as much as I do, then I like it as much as you. In it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all again really soon. Have a great fucking week. Keep warm. Keep safe. Don't get lost or stolen. And remember, people, smoking kills, vaping saves lives. Which do you choose? I'll see you all again real soon. Big love, everyone. Vaping kills. Sorry, smoking kills. Not the first time I've fucked that up, is it? Everybody, they never let you forget. All that work I do for charity, all that fucking stuff I do for the kids and all the rest of it. Built that bridge. Do they call me Ralphie the Bridge Builder? No. Shag one fucking donkey and that's the fucking end of it. So remember people,